Hello and welcome to uh, my train game. This is one of my newer games on my laptop. This is Railroad Simulator. It's powered by Trains 12. And today I'm going to show you how to make a freeway light with the next new street on 610 in Houston, Texas. My Houston, Texas right? This is Houston, Texas. This has just mostly lights. Just my, this is like mostly my ATLS lights. But today, I'm going to show you how to make a freeway light on your train game. It's going to power by, it's going to be have a train track with it. As you see right here, this is going to include traffic lights, stoppers, and etc. etc. slaves and uh, we need some um, new grade crossings. So let's get started. We'll start with going to our objects box. Then we will go to our roads. And I am going to pick this road here. The road that I'm about to pick for you in just a moment as I scroll up. As I scroll up, it looks pretty blurry on my camera, but I'm going to show you the road I'm about to pick. And it's going to be Road Freeway 01. It's, it's going to be a back way and a fourth way. As I show you how it's built. Excuse me if my hand is in my way because I am trying to record this on my phone while working at the same time. So now we're moving a little away, moving back a little more. Excuse me for my mouse. It's, I'm still learning how to use this thing still. But we're going to move over just a little bit more because I'm too close to the train. So give me a second. Okay, perfect for right here. This is perfect. Give me a second. So, um, these need to be continued until I get this fixed the way I want it. Okay, now we're ready. Now we're going to do it like this. If I can find my mouse, there it is. Okay, and now we're at this road. Okay, and then we are going to keep going. We're going to keep going. We're not going to make the like the um, other kind of roads like in one of the videos on YouTube. I am planning this to put on YouTube to show everybody else how you can build, you make different ways to make your traffic lights. And a little later, I'll show you how to make a three way traffic light way off of this train game. That's my new train game. I'm still learning mice and phrases as you know it's okay. So I'm about to do the undo to get some cars and make sure I have the roads on the correct way. Okay, so I'm undoing and then we're gonna put the rope and the road's gonna come back as you see there. And now we'll look for cars. I see so far this hold on. See, so far there's no cars. As I refresh the road, we might make more cars come. Okay. One side is right. Now we're going to go back down to the other side and do the same thing the other way. And then we're going to do it for the other side. As you see there. You see right here. Now, if I can get my mouse to work right, and then we snake move the road on all the way over there, all the way down, all the way down, keep going, 
Here you go. And then we're going to refresh this road. Now, it might be you're going to have to turn your roads. Because I had to do that since the cars are driving on the wrong direction. So you might might have to do that. Okay, now this is where you do. You hit undo. Now I didn't know what just happened there, but I am about to get rid of it. And we're going to undo and redo. Now check for cars. Now we're going to do it again because there's no cars on both roads. And now we check and you see cars are going I see cars on this side is right cars on the other side are not so as I arrange this I would like you to put this on hold this one to take 11 minutes but he has camp for it I don't I had no stand I had nothing to put it on oh. Snack time too. Oh, now I'm gonna get busy trying. Do this. Hey guys, penguins and polar bears are not the only difference between the South and North Pole. In fact, these two places are literally polar opposites. Just give me one second, people, and I will get right back to you. Right now, I'm trying to correct the roads the way I'm wanting them to be, so the cars will drive right. So I'm putting this on my camera. I am putting on hold. I will show you how, show you y'all just you know how to do it. Pretty much all year round. It's, um, very much it's pretty easy. All you gotta do is go all the way back and come back around, turn around, and come all the way back. See, it was supposed to continue all the way down, but I ran out of room for road. I ran out of room on land. I love the expense of more on the land, but um, this is how far it was supposed to go anyway. Or towards the plains. Now this is the next new route. It's uh, West Belfort in Houston. It's gonna go from. It's supposed to go from um, Highway Six, which some of y'all people from Houston should know. If not, then you just don't know what I'm talking about. But if you know West Belfort in Houston, Texas, um, this, this is the next new route that I'm gonna building. I have not started working on it yet, but it's going to be ready probably by the end of October. Because I'm about to start on it, and today's the 23rd. And with all these games I got, I can't do it. So um, now we'll check for cars. As you see, there's no cars on the road yet, but they will be pretty soon. Just got to keep refreshing the roads, and there don't be cars on the road. Okay, so you see there's no, no, okay, here's a car, and it's going the right way, and then there should be another car, yes it is, right here, and he's going the correct way. Now these are just like a highway. They like going like thirty or twenty. Like it's a regular road. So now as we got the roads the way I wanted them. Now we're gonna go right back over here down to the tracks. And we're gonna just just stop right here. Okay. So you go from your roads, just right back to your object mode. So, and from your spine menu, back to your roads. Just give it a little while. Okay. And then, you go up here, type in ATLS. Give me a second, I'm trying to watch my keyboard while I type this in. And you see, it's not in the right order I like it in. And it's supposed to be in the 
There we go. Now it's doing it. Okay. So when you see this eight TLS controller, put two down, but not in the same area. I'll show you. Okay, so you put a controller here, and then you go all the way to the other side of the feeder road of 610. If you know what I'm talking about, we live in Houston, Texas. And there's your other side of your controller, as you see right there. Now, what you do is you hit the question mark that says the hiss right there and it says edit properties and just hit the letter in and it should hit, go to the highlight the question mark and now as I move all the way back over because I'm gonna start with the other side there's a little while I gotta adjust my roads as I keep going down but I'm about to stop on this route for a little while we get started with Belfort start with the land once I finish the land, I'll come back with another recording with the first light, the first ATLS light. Okay, so now if you got your controller, you go ahead and hit the controller. And it's going to pop up this. This is the properties. This is the properties. This is the channel that I wanted, that you wanted to control your traffic lights or your railroad crossings. I'll show you how to make railroad crossings in my next video. Okay, this is what you do. You go to here and you type in the next channel. Now this is my next channel on this route, which is 111. And there's the channel here. If yours, if yours is new, you put it now as Route 1. Mine is 111. This is going to have... Oh, I'm trying to get my camera right here. My hand's going to hurt. And I'm about to stop it and I'm going to continue on Part 2. This is going to have about two parts to it. Because they don't have let me have a little length of video on YouTube. Okay, and it has gonna have five routes. This is gonna have five routes and three phrases. The phrases is the turn traffic and the three phrases, as everyone knows. Now, channel one is gonna have the first light is gonna go first. Okay, then you hit here. Route two is the traffic cross traffic route three is the turn traffic for route one so it can change and it's gonna change with it's gonna change with um, turn right gonna change with straight light after that phrase route four is the straight the straight traffic coming through and route five is the tracks and route two is gonna have the green light doing the SPL event See, it says on SPL event, Route 2 will go. Let me get you a better understanding, but my camera's acting up. So I can get you a good understanding. If I can't zoom in, it's going to get all blurry. So that's what I'm going to have to do. Okay, on my next video, after we show you how to do timings for the phrases, on the next video, it's going to show you the second one. That's how I try to post this on YouTube. Okay, the turn light is going to be short. Got to be short. This got to have about 18 seconds for the turn light. And this needs to be high 10. No, the lights is going to be out of sync. But they will catch up with each other once the trains go through. Then they'll be back in sync. Now they get out of sync again and they keep doing it over and over again. So just just leave it alone. It'll be okay. You need to reset the controller. That's all you can do. Got the last five seconds, and that is just like an automatic setting. So I'm done with the first one. Next, um, on my next one, I'll show you how to do. I'm gonna tell you to do the next controller on the next video. 
Thanks for watching, guys. Part 2 is on its way. Thank you.